Good morning, class. So today we're going to be learning about multiplication. I know, I know, it's going to be fine. Oh, hello, Miss Hills. Morning, Mr. Davis. This is Gethin, your new pupil. Ah, Gethin, come on in. Thank you, Miss Hills. Come on in. Why don't you tell the class a little bit about yourself, Gethin? My name is Gethin. I'm ten. And I live with my grandfather. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anything else? Okay, I'll put you out of your misery. Take a seat, Gethin. Right now, as I was saying, multiplication is when you multiply a number by another number. That's a lot. Here you go. I think they might have crumpled some pages. So about recent this meets at school. They're still doing. I'm here, by the way. Okay, Finn. You walking home? Yeah, to my grandfather's house. Go if I tag along. You can tell me about this bee business. So what's with all this bee stuff? Why do you like them so much? Well, my whole family have been beekeepers, so I've always been around bees. That's so cool. Yeah, they're misunderstood. Not many people understand how important they are. What do you mean important? Well, they pollinate the most fruit and vegetables we eat in the world. Strawberries, apples, tomatoes and almonds. They're all pollinated by bees. No way, I'm going to look at that later. Good day, Gethin. Hiya, Gramps. This is Nia. Hiya, Nia. How are you? Glad to see that Gethin's made a friend. See, he's been telling you about the bees. Would you like to see some? Yes, please. Come on, then. Don't worry, Nia. They're not going to sting you. If they sting you, they'll die. They're just working. What do you mean, working? See that flower over there? That yellow bit mm. in the centre? That's where the pollen and nectar are made. Bees collect it to make it honey. It's not all about the honey, it's about pollination. Pollination? Pollination is how flowers with this. The stuff that gives you hay fever? Well, think as pollen, as tiny dust of seeds, when they collect the nectar, the pollen sticks on them. And when they go to another flower, the pollen falls off, fertilising it. It's about how plants and flowers make other plants and flowers. Nectar is nature's reward for the bees. So, if we didn't have any more bees, we wouldn't be able to grow any more flowers? It's not about the flowers, it's about the food. See. Some plants are wind pollinated, whilst some of the more colourful flowers and vegetables are pollinated by bees. Like this tomato. Bees help us to make them. If the bees were all gone, then the whole ecosystems would collapse. The food chain would break down. We need to plant native wild plants to help 
our pollinator friends. You probably learnt about a lot of this in school. No, we haven't. You should come in and tell everyone about it in class. Oh, I, I don't think I could do that. Oh, come on. None of the kids in school know any of this stuff. And if it's as important as you say, then you have to let everyone know. We have to do our part. Right, now we've got a very special guest coming in to see us this morning. And this is Gethin's grandfather coming to talk to us about bees. Say hello. 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 Oh. hello. Right, hands up all those of you who like bees. Okay, well I can tell you now that by the end of the morning you'll all be putting your hands up. So, let's get started. <laughs> 